Yo guys, welcome back to another Damachi Morpheus video. Okay, so I was just gonna do like a no commentary double seventh zone clearing both seventh zones uh, video, but then I realized I always skip <laughs> the dark seventh zone because I just never have a team to do it with. And then I did a couple of summons on the current rerun banner and I pulled another, well, I say a couple, I, yeah, I did two. And then I got like my guaranteed and got an extra copy of Zard, which takes him up to plus three now i always believe that a unit isn't really like the majority of units are just not usable before at least being plus three limit broken um so here we are now usually like i keep that in mind i did say usually i don't feel like units are usable or even useful at all unless they're at least plus three but that's usually there are outliers and you know things that do not follow that rule but I came over here, um, I this hit, gave me an excuse, I, I created his weapon, I did his weapon up, I'm just, I was re-rolling for the stats, but I'm not, I'm not sitting there, I've got like over 1200 um, items to re-roll his stats for, and I'm just not getting the double crit strength stat that I want, uh, I could probably keep going for a four stat, but there's no point going for four stats when my unit's not even max limit broken, anyway, so it, I'm, I'm rambling, right. Uh, this is the team as you can see the only MLB unit on here is Haruhime except for the assists And this is where I want to point out that assists really do carry your team um, I, We're gonna get into it and I'm gonna show you uh, Usually I wouldn't commentate uh, seven zone anymore because these videos really get any views like the only people that watch these videos are people that actually want to uh, <laughs> watch me for me i guess is is how you would phrase it uh, rather than watch the channel for for dumb much you like you understand what i'm saying yeah, you get it um <laughs> uh so we're gonna start off here uh now i haven't used i'm not gonna lie to you i've since pulling this zard and um the alpha and on the original banner and everything like that i've not used any of these except the erebus assist uh so this is actually my first time using them i'm not sure of the rotation pretty sure this is supposed to be the next one and then i go straight to he only gets two additionals that's kind of sucky which means i need to reset those additionals but it is a super modifier even though it is an aoe but it's obviously i'm going to do this for the resistance debuffs single target extend it light resist down by 40 percent allies light attack damage plus 35 percent yeah this is the only problem i think i think zard doesn't buff his own light he buffs his strength uh, which is how war game units usually run. They have to operate together to be useful. Um, in saying that, I still have to hope that the guy, there is obviously an RNG possibility here that without a counter or anything like that, the uh, <laughs> one of these guys is going to get one shot. <laughs> um, but we'll see. I have an additional and then I'm going to reset. So we're going to do straight to skill free. And something's telling me this skill free is actually going to hurt a lot. Let me read it out here. So uh, plus 40% for every self strength buff with a ultra crit rate, which means he's probably going to crit, which means he's probably going to do some dirt. Um, <laughs> the thing is, the biggest worry I have here is right here with the bait. Um, the thing is, he's got beast killer. I think it's beast killer. So he should do damage as well. Uh, and hopefully when Haruhime SAs and everyone gets 85% light damage, we'll we'll really see this team come together. 200 and... Whoa! Okay, over 300k damage. And, um, I mean, obviously it's not a fair representation. This is a, a enemy that's specifically weak. Uh, minus 105% weak to um, light. That's not including the 45%. What? No. Okay, stop this nonsense. Okay, we're going to essay with Haruhime. Because I literally just want to... I'm not going to essay with OG Haruhime because there's no point. Everyone seems to have buffed their magic and strength relatively high. Makes more sense to push everyone's light damage up over their strength and magic at this point. Um, don't need to extend buffs. He gets no additionals, so I can just spam his skill free now. We're going to reset his additionals uh, so he can do that. I mean, it's like 60 something. It's probably going to be higher now. It's probably going to be about 70 to 80% damage now. Uh, after this SA, I'm rambling so much because I'm actually interested to see what happens. You know, I've never watched this SA animation, I don't think, so I'm going to watch this one through. <laughs> they usually do okay with the Haruhime SA animations. The recent water one was a bit... It was questionable. They usually do okay. Okay, I understand that he's not going to... Slow your roll, sir. Slow your roll, sir. 
<laughs> uh, okay, right, so we're gonna we go back to his skill free now, and this is the real test. We're gonna see how, just how much damage he really is gonna do with this. Keep in mind, both him and the bait heal when they counter attack 274, 79, 200. What? I mean. I'm actually really surprised with the bait too. I know he's got Beast Killer, which gives him an additional 50%, but the damage numbers I'm seeing out of these two are actually really amazing. If this was any other Dark Zone, like any other enemy, the Zard would probably hold up, but most likely not the bait. Uh, and unfortunately, my light team, my, my the roster of light units that I have in my account is just... Uh, it's not even worth mentioning. Like, 800... Mm, doing less than a million damage but she herself is only plus three as well so uh, i'm literally running with a team that could be so much more than it is there we go the self-sustain as well um do i have additionals do i need to reset additionals um i do not have additionals but i want to see how much health it has left 3.3 mil okay you know what i'm gonna reset those additionals i'm gonna use suga now uh, go straight back to here, get the regen plus the extra damage. Um, and we should be set. I, unless something goes terribly wrong, like, you know, Zard getting hit and not countering uh, repeatedly. Ah, oh, man, I need to put Zard. Um, in the future, I'm going to need to put Zard to the left of OG Haruhime because if he counters, then he heals himself. And then Haruhime can counter and heal someone else, if that makes like. So you, you follow what I'm saying here, right? Uh, if he can heal himself, there's no need for, for me to want Haruhime to heal him. So if I can just make sure that he has enough counter rate, uh, he should last by himself. 189k, man, a plus three. The guy is crazy. I mean, his counters are a bit poop. Uh, but I think that's because he doesn't, if I, if I remember correctly, he doesn't have any elemental damage on his counters. Uh, and that's why the counters don't do that much damage. But still, uh, I think that's for balancing issues because he heals for a certain amount of damage on his counters. So uh, if he did too, and it's percentage based. So if he did too much damage on his counters, then he would just be unkillable if you could make him counter every turn so there we go i didn't even set what turn that was this is actually given level 72 72 and 60 this was the uh, surprising one i'm so like not the damage like he's got beast killer but uh the fact that he survived and he didn't have a <laughs> maxed out assist on him was actually really cool to be fair um I'm not going to run the other 7th zone, uh, I just literally was so excited to, to think, oh my, 18.6 mil, <laughs> wow, um, I was just excited to test out, like, because I've never had a, a light team to use in 7th zone before, I usually do normal and hard and then skip very hard, uh, when AoE 7th zone comes around, I may struggle, um, you know what, I'm going to show you my light roster, um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to show you my my, my uh, light unit roster, and you'll see what I'm talking about here. So light units, four stars. Let's have a look. See, um, this guy. I hate him so much. He's so bad. He's such a bad unit. Everything about him screams under par. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is my roster. Uh, even I have MLB Lean Eight. Don't be fooled, man. She does no damage. Does no damage at all. Look at the stats. Balance type. No damage. No bueno. Um, but yeah, that's like this is this is what I got to work with, man. Uh, it's not good at all. So whenever Dark Zone comes around, I usually skip it. <sighs> Hopefully, things start looking up. I'm gonna start prioritizing my light units over other elements for now. Um, but I am also going to be saving for the collab. Once I've finished summoning whatever I need to on these current banners, I'm saving for the collabs. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please make sure to drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you're not. Uh, social media links will be in the description. Oh, also added the donation link like I said I would in a previous video. I'm trying to save up for a new microphone and a camera. Uh, I will add um, the... Uh the the goal and how far we are somewhere on, on the screen at screen at some point but yeah no so yeah anyway guys that's gonna be it uh as always i love you and i'll catch you later